Hello, this is Frank, that one web guy, and I'm back with another video. In this video, I wanted to show you something cool that I just found uh, recently, something I've been using uh, for probably about a month or two. Uh, thought I'd share it with you. I know a lot of times we look through websites or, you know, we're going through the web and find the site that we like, um, and you can like, well, how do they do that? You know, are they using a certain theme? Are they using a plugin? You know, as most sites today, or many sites, not most, many sites today are using uh, WordPress as the back end. You know, so WordPress has many different themes and many different plugins. So you're like, oh, I wonder what theme that is, or I wonder what plugins they're using, or how do they do that type of thing, you know. Um, sometimes you can't figure out how they're doing it, but if you can figure out the tools that they're using for the website, then, uh, you know, it just makes it a little bit easier to, you know, recreate it for yourself, or that, if that's something you're wanting to do. Now, one of the things that, uh, on my site here, um, you know, I'm using my site as the example, and of course, it's a WordPress site, and I use a lot of plugins and things. But I found this cool Chrome extension. Um, if you look up here on my in my browser, um, it, there's this little W, and I'll show you what the extension is here in just a moment. But um, if I if I click on that, um, it'll actually pull up and it'll show me that uh, I'm using the Impala Boulevard theme. Uh, that's the theme that I'm using, um, and that's a thumbnail of what the you know from the website owner itself. And if I scroll down though, it'll start showing um, I'm using a testimonials plugin. As you know, shows it's a premium theme. Um, it's also showing you know I'm using Contact Form Seven, um, Crown Syntax Highlighter, Easy Bootstrap Shortcode, uh, Deferred JavaScripts, and of course I use that for um, speeding up my site. And it, I'll just keep scrolling. Of course, it's still trying to determine and load, but you know you can kind of see um, how easily it is then to to even see what these are. You know, so I can actually say, like, well, what's Crown Syntax Highlighter? So if I click on that, it uh, it's going to open up another page here that actually will take me to that um, that resource, and it'll explain what it is. Now, occasionally I'll use um, I'll include in one of my blog posts. I'll show how to you know to get the code or how to you know the code that you can copy to put on your own website or something if I'm demonstrating something so I, I like this uh, this plugin um, so that's just one of the things I'm using but I just thought I'd share that with you and it's really a cool Chrome extension um, and actually you can get that Chrome extension um, I have it pulled up over here um, if you go to or you can go to um, right there's what it is WordPress theme plugins detector um, and I'll try to include a link on this blog post as well. But um, if you go to your settings for Chrome, you can add extensions. Um, click over here on the left, go to extensions, and then you can just uh, you can add an extension as well. So you just want to do that. Um, you know, get more extensions down here at the bottom, and then you just locate that that one that we mentioned, uh, which is, of course is the um, WordPress theme plugin detector. So you just put that in the search, find it, and then add it, and you'll have that thing as that little uh, thing here as well. So uh, I hope you find this useful. Uh, check back to my blog on occasion. Um, I make additional posts and videos such as this, and uh, I'll be back again soon. Thanks.